Uh, I cannot explain to you. Uh, I mean, a 1% state of dehydration will negatively impact your performance by as much as 10 to 12%. 1% dehydration, a 10% miss in, in, your, uh, in your performance. It's huge. Does anybody know how much water they should be drinking every day regardless of fitness? Bingo. Half your body weight in ounces. And that is not inclusive of any training. If you're training, that's another 16 to 20 ounces an hour. Okay? So if you got an hour of training, you got a half an hour CrossFit wide in the morning and a CFE wide later, and it's in half and half, that's 8 to 12 ounces in the morning, another 8 to 12 ounces uh, during and post-workout. But outside of the rest of the day, if you weigh 150 pounds, you got another assignment of 75 ounces for the rest of the day. Okay? And I don't care who you are. And then if you're training, how much more work? It's the same deal. Every hour of training, it's, about, it's rough. Now, look, don't get me wrong here. Um, and I'm going to show you some other stuff here in a minute. Um, that is the 72, 73 degree answer. Okay? You want the 78, you want the 82, the 84? Tell you what, at about 88, somebody who's 160 pounds ought to be putting down 32 to 34 ounces an hour. If you're going to go out for an hour long, you know, a half, you're going to run a half marathon in 90 degree heat, you just signed up for 35, 36 ounces of water. It's that significant, and it's that almost ridiculously exponential. Okay? Oh, yeah. Okay. But generally speaking, it's a minimum. You're looking at 16 ounces an hour. Okay? Activity. Outside of activity, half your body weight in ounces of water. Okay? You know, the, the coffee thing gets a, a, a bad rap because, believe it or not, if you have like 30 ounces of coffee and the diuretic kind of... Um, uh, effects of that much coffee and, and, and the diuretic effects of having 30 ounces of water. Generally speaking, if you drank an, a liter of water right now, do you think you'd have to go to the bathroom? Yeah. Yeah, okay. So the diuretic differences of just drinking too much of anything, I mean, it, it, it's, it's, um, it's, just, it's just not worth wor worrying about. I mean, I wouldn't go down this route of, oh my God, caffeine, I need to offset it. It's just not that significant, okay? Um, you know, if you feel bad about it or you read a certain article, Sure, you know, I have a couple more extra ounces, but, you know, I, I wouldn't sit there and say, oh, my God, I just drank coffee. I need to offset. I have five classes. I have five, you know, I have uh, 40 ounces of coffee. Got to go drink 80 ounces of water or something. Don't, don't, it, it gets a little bit too much press, so I, I wouldn't be too concerned about it. Would that be the same thing for alcohol, too? <laughs> so the next time you go on a bender before you do Fran, what I would do, <laughs> no, I, I, again, let's not overdo this. I, I think that all I... Something tells me that the vast majority of this audience or almost other, regardless of all the water bottles here, but I, I don't know how many of you right now would sign your name to say I, I religiously drink half of my body weight in water every day. If you do, fantastic, okay? But something tells me that the majority of folks, generally speaking, don't. Yeah. Oh, you're, you're saying you do it. It's, that's awesome. Yeah. So does it mean anything to you if you miss your water? Yeah. You bet your butt, right? Yeah. You feel like garbage, don't you? You feel terrible? You actually feel, lose flexibility? Exactly, right? And by the way, you do have a hangover. Why? Just like the oil in a car, the car isn't going to move right. If you don't have enough hydration in your muscle, your muscle tissue and everything, you're just not gonna, it's not going to work right. And until you go down this path, guys, you don't know what you're missing. So I'm not going to listen to folks who explain to me why they can't drink this water because they have to go to the bathroom too much. You don't understand what you're missing. Okay? So please, if you're not doing it, I strongly suggest going down that path. Okay?